everybody, Mr. Balfour here. I got my great helper, Evan. We're going to be showing you guys some striking, just using a simple balloon. Okay, so you just need a dollar store balloon or any kind of balloon, not with helium. Okay, blow it up, whatever size that you think will work best for you. And then we're going to be trying to do some single hand striking as our first activity. So you're just going to take your hand flat, opposite foot forward. You're going to rock back swing and step forward as you strike your balloon up. Okay, if you can catch it, catch it. If not, chase it down, pick it up, and try it again. Once you get one strike down, rock back, step forward, and strike. Okay, then you're going to try to do five. So five in a row. Evan will show you now. Okay, go ahead, Evan. One. Try to keep it up. Do it again. Two. Good. All right, so you get the idea. So you're going to do five of those. Then we're going to try a continuous strike where we don't let the balloon hit the ground. Now, this is a little bit more dynamic, so you're not going to be standing in a stationary position you know, opposite foot forward, rock back, swing, step, and strike. Okay, you're going to actually strike, and then you're going to be moving around, trying to get your body in position to keep the balloon from hitting the floor. All right, and we want to try to just use one hand. So pick your favorite hand, the hand you write your name with, that would be your dominant hand, and try to give that a go. All right, so we're going to try to do five in a row without letting it hit the ground. Ready, Evan? All right, here we go. Set, go. One, two, three. Four, five, and if you can do five, okay, it's okay if it hits the ground, just pick it up and try it again. So let's say I didn't get to five, I only got to three, I'll try it again. So then it, once I get to five, my next challenge is going to be ten in a row. So same thing, one hand, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Watching it with my eyes, tracking it, striking with the Pull my hand. Then we're going to try 15, 20. All right. Trying to get as many as we can in a row. All right. So you guys try that. Just pause the video and try that now. All right. Next, we're going to try to strike with our opposite hand. So instead of using the hand I write my name with, we're going to strike with the opposite. So first strike again, it's going to be stationary, opposite foot forward, rock back, step forward, swing, and strike. So we're going to get five of those, okay, and then we're going to try it the more dynamic way, which is just strike, 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 without the rock back. So you're going to strike once, and then continuous, okay, and again, we're going to try to do this five times in a row, then we're going to try ten times in a row, fifteen, 15 in a row. and then twenty, all right, let's go ahead and pause the video and try that now with your opposite hand. All right, next. We're going to try to strike it with different parts of our body. Okay, so we could use our cranium or our head. We could use our elbow, our shoulder, knee. our knee. Okay, so go ahead and try those now. Okay, just give it a bop or a strike or a tap. You can use different body parts like the knee, elbow, head, or shoulders. Okay, so go ahead and pause the video and try some of those moves now. So. Head, shoulder, elbow, knee. You could even use your foot and try to tap it up with your foot. All right, so how many did you get? How many different body parts could you use? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, next challenge is to use your any body part you want and try to keep it up as long as you can. So you could use your shoulder, your elbow, your knee, your foot, your hand. Opposite side, okay, chest. chest, and just try to keep your balloon going as long as you can. So Evan's going to give his go right here. I'll do mine in the background. Go ahead, buddy. As many as you can. One, two. All right, good job. So go ahead and pause the video and try to do that. Any body part you have that you can use, try to keep your balloon up as long as you can. How many can you do without it touching the ground, okay? All right, last thing. So now that you know the different skills you can try to do with your hand, opposite hand, maybe striking with your head, your shoulder, elbow, knee, or foot, okay? or, your chest. or your chest, 
Okay, go ahead and stop this video and go ahead and practice those. Come back and check it out again if you forget what the challenges are and have fun playing with your balloon. All right, be well.